Let's take a quick look at how to clear all the cache folders on your Apple Mac computer. Doing this can free up a bit of space on your computer, or it can just do a quick refresh on some of the applications that you have installed. You can also do this if you're having any cache issues or problems. But clearing up your cache doesn't necessarily speed up your computer though, since cache in its purpose is supposed to speed things up. But if you are having any issues again, this could help. We'll take a look at two levels that we're gonna be clearing. The first is your user cache, and then after that, we'll clear out the system cache. To find the user cache folder, start by heading to your desktop here. From the menu bar at the top, select Go. To show the hidden library folder, hold down the option key, and then you'll see library appear in the list here. Go ahead and select that now. Next, find the cache folder and then double click it to open. If you wanna see how much space is being taken up inside of here, you can either head up to file and choose get info, and you'll see the size here, or you can use the shortcut when you have any folder selected and on your keyboard, hit Command and I at the same time. Once we see about how much space is gonna be cleared up by doing this, we can go ahead and close this and then back in the folder, select everything by pressing Command and A at the same time, or you can go up to the top and select Edit and select All. Next, right click on a folder anywhere inside of here and then here, choose Move to Trash. Finally, after that, you can right click on the trash folder down here in the corner and then choose empty trash. Next, let's clear our system cache. Again, from the top menu, select go, but this time choose computer. From this folder, choose your Macintosh hard drive and then after that, library. Find the caches folder inside of here and again, select everything and then either right click and choose move to trash or just go ahead and drag these to the trash. Now you may run into an issue here with the system cache where you get an error where you aren't able to delete some of this or you're asked to put in your system password. If that happens, it's fine. That's because it's cache that's either currently in use or it's system level and it just can't be deleted. And again, after that, right click on the trash can and then choose empty trash. And again, because of the actual purpose of cache is speeding up your computer, you may find now that your computer or the apps that you use will be a little slow at first, but that's because it's building new cache every time you're using it. But after you do use your computer for a little bit, the apps and the things that you use more often will begin to speed up once that cache is created. But at the same time, all that extra cache that you're not using anymore will be cleared up and won't be taking up space on your machine. You can then continue using your computer after you do this, but I usually recommend right now rebooting your machine before you do anything else. And it's that easy to clear the system and user cache from your Apple Mac computer. Thanks for watching.